In this video, we are going to talk about the, the best exercises for massive arms. So before starting this video, please like this video and subscribe to our channel for future updates. Bigger biceps and triceps are frequently on the list of lifters seeking to bulk up. While having large arms may not indicate how much you can lift, they can certainly help you in heavy pushing and pulling actions. So, what exactly is the best bulking arm workout? When bulking up the biceps and triceps, it is advisable to include a variety of motions, such as barbell curls, dumbbell curls, pull-ups, and dips that span the rep range 6 to 20 reps. For optimum growth, exercises should be spread out over 2 to 3 days. Here, the list of the best exercises for massive arms. Let's start. Number 8. Close Grip Bench Press. Close grip bench press is excellent for developing upper body pressing strength. A close grip is typically characterized as maintaining your hand's shoulder width apart and your elbows tucked underneath the barbell as you descend it to your chest. The narrower grip, as opposed to the normal bench press, emphasizes the triceps. Training them with larger loads is frequently limited by the triceps, making them an excellent approach to increase tricep strength. Number 7. Cable Curl. Another curl variation that can be performed similarly to the dumbbell or barbell curl is the cable curl, which is commonly performed while standing. Unlike free weights, cables may maintain constant strain on the muscle and stress it the same way throughout the entire range of motion. Even while free weights are useful, they lack muscle contraction near the apex of the movement, past the sticking point. As a result, machine-based bicep exercises, such as the cable curl, can maintain tension at the top of the range of motion that isn't stimulated to the same extent in other exercises. Number 6. Preacher Curl. The preacher curl is an isolation exercise in which the lifter rests their elbows and upper arms on an angled pad that provides support throughout the movement. By keeping the shoulders anchored to the pad, you reduce the capacity of the anterior delt to employ momentum to lift the weight, just like the spider curl. You can create a deep contraction and target the bicep peaks by expanding the range of motion. The preacher curl can be performed with two different types of equipment, the easy curl bar or dumbbells. To target the bicep in somewhat different ways, rotate between the two devices every four to six weeks. Number 5. Spider Curl. The spider curl is a hybrid of the preacher curl and the chest-supported curl. By lying face down on an incline bench, you can enhance biceps range of motion while decreasing momentum. This is a fantastic action if you experience shoulder joint pain when performing bicep curls since it eliminates the activation of the front delt that is often present during other bicep variations. Number 4. Seated Incline Dumbbell Curl. Because it expands the range of motion, performing dumbbell curls from a seated incline position targets the biceps more than other workouts. This allows you to get a full muscular contraction cycle while simultaneously working to reduce movement velocity and isolate the biceps across the whole muscle belly. This is often trained in the moderate rep range, however it can occasionally be done with higher rep sets. Number 3. Dumbbell Curl. The dumbbell curl can be programmed and trained similarly to the barbell curl, but it also allows lifters to alter their wrist rotation. Another advantage of the dumbbell curl is that it allows you to train each arm unilaterally, one at a time, allowing you to correct any imbalances between the right and left sides. Number 2. Barbell Curl. The barbell curl is a well-known bicep workout that, when performed correctly, no heaving or swinging the weight, can result in bigger, wider biceps. Training them with heavier to moderate weights is a wonderful alternative, as practicing them for high, Rep sets frequently results in sloppy reps, body swinging, and excessive momentum consumption. If you notice yourself swinging, reduce the weight or switch to one of the machine-based routines listed below, where cheating is less possible. Number 1. Chin-ups. Chin-ups are excellent for developing upper body pulling strength. Because of the grip position, they put more attention on the biceps than pull-ups, palms facing you as they grab the bar. Training with bigger loads is frequently limited by arm strength, whereas training with higher rep ranges is frequently limited by grip strength and muscle endurance. That's it for today. We hope you found our video interesting. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up and share it with others. Also, if you haven't already, please consider subscribing to our channel. 
Don't forget to turn on the notification bell so you don't miss any of our new uploads. In the end, thanks for watching and see you next time.